know that Sable Island is moving? The Sable Island is constantly moving, but it's not actually shifting in location. What's happening is that the arms, the extensions of the island are retracting and then extending. It gives you an impression that the island is moving. And we've seen this most recently where uh, a pipe rack that used to be on the north side of the beach, we now see on the south side of the beach because the entire arm has shifted northwards. How come Sable Island only has one tree on it? There's a great story for trees on Sable Island. It's not an island that has spittable to trees. Despite that, they tried to plant almost 100,000 trees 100 years ago, and not a single one of those survived. We do have one small Scots pine tree that survives from a planting effort in the 1950s in a very sheltered area. Why does Sable Island have that nickname? Sable Island has a tragic history of seeing many shipwrecks in and around the island. And it used to be in the days of sail, right on the most direct path from the North American continent back to the old world in England. And at the same time, you have this mixing of cold and warm water that creates these treacherous fogs and underlying sandbanks that led to the loss of many ships and lives. Can you tell me a fun fact about the horses on Sable Island? The horses have a lot of mystique on Sable Island. One of the things that I found remarkable is you walk around and you see these little pyramids of horse droppings everywhere. And these are called stud piles. And the horses make them and urinate on them. And the chemical signature in the urine communicates to the other stallions about who's around, who's in the neighborhood. Can you tell me about the colony of gray seals on Sable Island? Sable Island is the world's largest gray seal colony. And what's remarkable is that they come in the winter time to have their pups. It's cold, it's windy, and there are hundreds of thousands of seals on the beach having pups all up and down Sable Island. And it's an amazing time of year. The smells and the sounds are out of this world. <laughs> 